flag flies. A lot, a lot of great cars in this one. Look at this. Oh, and Van Epperick goes between, tries to split them. Yeah, Michaud got a little bit crossed up there in turn one, had to gather it back up. That'll put Corey Weller, the number 48, out front. Corey Weller, the number 48 Can-Am, made a mistake that hands the lead over to C.J. Greaves in his brand new Polaris. Here comes Kyle Chaney. Chaney looking to the inside as they go down the back stretch. He'll try to outbreak Weller. Watch Chaney, he's gonna try to fade it out all the way around and get a good apex. And look at, making that pass stick, passing Corey Weller. Outside pass and he made it work. Kyle Chaney from Miller Sport, Ohio, now up into second place here in Pro Turbo side-by-side. -side. Here comes a race for the lead. Look at this, he's a Reeves has, has a, a flat right yeah. rear tire on that number 33 Polaris. That is devastating. He was all alone out front. We'll see if he decides to pull into the hot pit and get this thing changed. Now all alone out front. CJ Greaves, by the way, has pulled into the hot pit, so they're gonna change that right rear tire before the competition yellow. Ronnie Van Epperen showing the way around. There's Owen Van Epperen trying to shift through the gears, get it wide open on this straightaway. Two different lines and one lap to go. Yeah, Owen trying to drive it to the bottom. He left the door open. He takes his father out. He collects himself, and he's still gonna take the win. One last time past the crowd here at Antigo. Rod Van Epperen narrowly hangs on for this round one win over Owen Van Epperen.